What's up guys, welcome back to Mario Party 5, episode 14, pretty much the finale of Underwater Dream. In the last episode, Haunted Flower, making a comeback. I mean, we've gotten a couple of stars, but man, Haunted Flower, uh, they're about to hit their third star from R7. And we still got the bonus stars, which, I mean, if they're all the same minigame coins and happening, we'll win two out of the three. Underwater Dream doesn't have that much, like, happening spaces, I've noticed. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm thrilled that they got three. Enough stars that they can get. Enough is enough. The next star you would chew for is right here. Oh my gosh. Seriously, each of us can pick areas and just get a star each turn. I have never seen this happen, ever. And I was like addicted to Mario Party when I was a kid. I, I was a dumb kid. I don't know why I was addicted to this game. And come on, man. Pick the one we haven't seen. Which one does... Oh, okay, cool. So I'll probably either win or lose. Rebelly tap A. Got it. All right, nope, I'm winning. I'm in first place. Because my star is rapidly going up higher compared to everyone else's. Come on, here we go, here we go. There we go, I was going to say almost there. Whew, gosh, I don't think I'm ever going to beat the record on that one. I think this is the last turn. Yep, last turn. Ah, oh, come on. No, Luigi, no. Oh, wait, do we have enough spaces to get to the star or no? Yes, we do. Finally. So we'll make double digits star wise I can't buy a star so see what you've done Luigi no I'm just kidding well I mean yeah yeah I, I I get it I understand why he went that direction so there's only six spaces that the stars pop up oh now I definitely can I get a star geez I hate the Koopa Bank. I hate that capsule. It's so annoying. Alright, turn me down to Elder Star. Oh. Ah, uh, okay, no, they're not gonna get the star either. You're gonna attack your own teammate. Oh well, they're not gonna start either. Jeez, that was stupid. Oh what? It didn't do anything. See, I wish stuff like that it would be like, hot sucker, you're on the exact same team. We're just gonna not show you the effect. Four stars. Wow. So like, no, what Daisy did really help their team. I mean, not help them enough to the point where they're going to beat us, but still, it did help them quite a bit. Because if that didn't happen, they would probably maybe have one star, and we'll have... I... Probably eight? Probably maybe less than that. Dude, come on, don't even show this. It's the exact same thing that just happened. With Boo, it's like, what? what is going on? That'd be awesome if it just ends in a... in a, a battle minigame. Mazed and confused. Last time this was super, super easy for me, so let's... Hopefully it'll be like that again.
Oops. Oh, cool. Awesome. I thought I was going to crash right into an electric field, and I'm like, oh, come on. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the award ceremony. That was fun, I thought. Mm-hmm, <laughs> nice work. Now let's see just how nice. First, let's take a look at the number of stars everyone has. The star count looks like this, 8 to 4. Next, we'll see how many coins you all managed to collect. I've tied the coins, and it looks like this, 23 to 10. Now let's hand out the bonus stars. Now we'll give a bonus star to the winner of each category. First is the minigame star. Yeah, it's the exact same categories. It's like, come on. Like, I think Mario Party 6, they introduced more categories. But I thought they did that in Mario Party 4 too. Huh. If it goes to them, I'll be really surprised. Nope. So, yeah, we got pretty much 10 stars throughout this whole thing. They got five, so they got half of what we got. Quick, simple math. You know what I'm saying? And finally, we come to the overall results. The game winner is... That'd be weird if we flew down and be like, wait, what? What's going on? Luigi and Toad's Good Pals team. You are the dream star. Dream star, not superstar. All right, continue. Cool, none of us land on Bowser and DK. I noticed it went a little quicker than the other uh, dreams, but also we're playing on 15 turns, so that's another thing as well. Wow, that's Undersea Dream. So, I thought it was fun, it was great. It was nice to see um, both our teams got a lot of stars. It's kind of crazy at the end, though, so I've never seen that happen. Five stars all at once? Jeez, that was awesome, though. Hopefully that happens again in the next two dreams, which that's all that we have left. If you guys like any video of the Undersea Dream, and including this one, make sure to give them a like. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next dream on episode 15 for Mario Party 5. See you guys later.